Nice, nice. <laughs> uh, John, John, Julie, and uh, Doug, Kyle, look at each other going, wait, what? Oh. Oh, sh Fuck, he did it! And there was like, yeah! <laughs> <laughs> there we go. Door to door salesman, you've walked into a very drunk gnome deciding to run up and down a pier with his trousers off. <laughs> Because he's looking for well, a crew. No, my dwarf. <laughs> he's looking for a crew to get on a boat, and he hasn't figured out what how to do it except get drunk people. So, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah, exactly. You're door, door. Good, <laughs> it good. is interesting. It worked then. Um, I I slowly walk back. Uh, get my trousers back on. Yep. Um, uh, ro ro I want to roll you twenty to see how much swag you had when you did all this. Will or without advantage? <laughs> well, with advantage, you won. Will it, will, like... Um, that's a 10. So a ten well, I don't know if uh, I get charisma, any... Charisma modifier. Or, yeah, charisma. Uh, yeah, okay. Let's see. That should be flat. Charisma is plus 1, so 11. So I, I realized it's on screen. Your charisma is... Yeah, plus 1, so 11. It's not as baller as you thought it might be because everyone's going bear and every like every, <laughs> like i know it's really really giving a fuck anymore because everyone who's there to spectate you is like bear 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 mm. and they're like already cheering you on and the other people are like fuck we lost and they're like the the three main characters who are your wit Ju Ju or doug uh, mm -hmm. julie and uh, john are like they're just like how they're just like they're singing like but like really badly because they're they think they can sing like all drunk yep. people and they're like singing some like utter utter horse crap like you can't even work out the words and they're like dancing to themselves but like everyone else is like uh like just going like like time to go get the drink <laughs> time to go get the drink <laughs> at, at this point, it's like it, it's up to the three of them to to pay them. Um, yeah, well, so that they, they have to go back and pay it. you. Yeah, that you won. You won. You clearly won this bet. And they didn't mm, realize. Yeah. Um, oh. But yeah, I, I, I look at the Dark John and Julie. So ready to listen now? They're like, well, yes, of course. You're a legend. You're a legend among men and dwarfs, I guess. Good. Yes. Thank you. I am. Um, do you have any experience sailing or being on a ship? Two of them go, yes, yes, of course. Uh, I've done the odd uh, fishing, like fishing. I've been on the odd fishing vessel and like, you know, I, I, I take it in the nets. I've done like the like repaired some ma one of them's like I've repaired a mast. So he's done like a lot of like the repair work and the other guy's like I've done some, some fishing. What's the longest trip any of you have been on then? Oh, long trips. Oh, and he's like, he looks like John looks at Doug and, Doug, and he's like, come on, man. Like, you know, that was a long ass trip. You, you know yourself. Like, come on, come on. Like, tell him, tell him. And he runs like, look, looks around and goes like, five whole days. Five whole days. Yeah. Okay. I want to give you an offer um, that will. Move your record up to between seven to ten days. Seven to ten days out in the sea. Are you mad? We have the most beautiful vessel with enough food yeah. for you. But we're going and... to fall off the face of the earth. Unless we're going to the mainland. That's that's like a. Are we going to the mainland? Like, what we're, oh, wait, sorry. We're jumping to conclusions here. Are you going to the mainland? We're going near it. Uh, we, we won't quite reach mainland. Uh, the, the route is quite complicated, but mm. I'll show you on the map. And, and, um, and why do you want us? Well, like, to be fair, I just want people with experience sailing, because I, for one, don't really have any. Um, so I need to make sure that whoever I recruit can and will hold up on a ship. Mm -hmm. uh, and right, I presume you're getting paid then. If you're trying to do a trip and you're not experienced, well... I'm not getting paid, but you, all three, if you accept, will be it will be getting paid. And they look at like uh, they look at Julie's like they look back at you, and they, the two lads look at Julie again. They're like look back at you, and this is kind of going on like you can get like they're 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 kind of trying to make a point. Do, mm. And do you get get what the point is, or do you not? No. Uh, so you look clueless back at them. They're like, um, you're good about girls on the boat. Like, isn't that? Bad luck. 
Are, isn't that, that going to make the, the Kraken come after us? The Kraken won't come after us, don't worry. Um, yes, it is set that women on boats will be bad luck. But, and looking for some kind of excuse here. Um, woman on the see. front of the boat, a statue of one. Well, yeah, but that's a statue. Um, but how does the Kraken know the difference? <laughs> fair, fair, you know what? Fair <laughs> point. So, Julie and Dark and John, let me let, let me ask you this: How does the Kraken know if there's a if there's a woman on board? Mm, roll me persuasion on that question. Not, well, persuasion is that the, the, the diplomacy? Diplomacy is not a thing, is it? Let me double check something here. I always think there's diplomacy should be a thing, but it's not diplomacy. It has to be well, but. Um, persuasion seems a bit wrong. Performance, per perception. Julie, if you're willing to dress up as a man, the Kraken will never know. Mm, well, I, I see. Like, how does the Kraken know? They're they're re they're like they're now like questioning life with the whole concept of. Of course, they're, they're questioning life. They saw a dwarf run seventy feet in less than six seconds. That is even more true. I mean, <laughs> they're looking at you going like, wait, wait, how does the Kraken know? They're just, they're just mumbling that like, wait. Like, they've all like, <laughs> completely like, you've broken them as human beings. It's like mm. telling someone, asking someone the question of, why is the world, like, why is it a globe? Like, yes, yeah. it logically makes sense. And when you do all, like a lot of the maths, but, but like, you were brought up told it's round. You never question the world it. runs on balls. Yeah, yeah, but like the point, like the point is, like it's that sort of logic. They're, 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 they're like now they're questioning what they've been taught, and you can see you've kind of like broken them as humans, um, mm. and they're very, they're very questioning of what's going on. It's like uh, I want to say, well, it, or Doug turns around and goes like, well, uh, if Judy comes, like what's she gonna do? She's never been on a boat. You want ah, to do? well, experience you'll get then. Uh, like, oh, the mainland. The mainland. Mm -hmm. Well, Tibbs looks up really quickly to see if he can find the world map without changing screen. He can't, so he's going to change screen. You could say it's a rocking time. And, and what port in the mainland are you going to uh, be going Give to? Give me a fucking map, mate. Give me a fucking <laughs> map. Because you're going the opposite way, by the way. You do realize. You know that, right? Yeah, of course. Oh, okay, yeah, okay, cool. Uh, are you on? Uh yeah I am okay let's see um yeah so I'm hoping we will reach uh Citrium but we might make port in Philea first. Oh, that's Don't lie saying. to our potential companions. <laughs> he is. You're not there. You're not there. You went to bed. I know I'm not. There. <laughs> This and the gnome's off scheming this is somewhere. Me, so don't fucking sabotage our mission by telling them we're going to the mainland. Can you roll me? Um, can you roll me persuasion, please? Yes. Uh, that will be an eight. The camera isn't updating on stream. Oh, it is. There we go. It is. Yeah. There's a. There's like a three second delay. Hmm. Oh, excuse me. Uh, so he's like, hmm, hmm. Hmm. Like, um, like, wh when when are you leaving? When are you leaving? Well, as soon as possible. Um, so depending on if you're ready tomorrow or the the day after, we will be leaving then. Uh, and what is the uh, like? How many other people do you have? It's a long trip. Do you have the supplies? Like, we we have a fully <laughs> supplied ship, and we have a captain as well as uh, a, a, another crewmate. Hmm. 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 Well, do you know? Do you know what this? Do you know what we need to do to just make our decision? No. Run they, for it. They look at you and go, "Drink to the bar." Sure thing. <laughs> yeah, they 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 ha they don't fully know. You think the two lads from like just looking at body language? Mm. You, they're they're com they're like quite convinced. Um, but. Julie, you can kind of see she's just very hesitant um, from mm. the body language, but you don't know yet. Um, well, they don't know what they're getting paid yet, so that's fine. 
yeah, you could tell them that. That could help. Well, they could ask. They did. They said, well, they, they could ask, actually, they didn't ask. They, yeah. they, they ask if they got payment, and sure, they will. But they so never I, I, ask I, as you come into the bar, you're about, um, you're like 30 seconds to a minute behind. Oh, for fuck, <laughs> this, we need to figure out why you're just somehow not seen as a player. Um, Thank you. Um, you're, you're 30, 40 seconds behind the rest of the crew that just saw mm-hmm. you roll with your trousers off, just for no reason. Um, and they're all like, as you walk in the door it's like you know when, when, when like the hero comes home and everyone's cheering yeah. or it, it's just like everyone everyone who was out there goes drink and i clap it and they're all going mental and they're all so happy <laughs> nice it worked then <laughs> yeah but they want their drink well yeah but i i i told you that the three of them will pay, so I had kind of hoped you would had make them throw the money at them, uh, at them. Therefore, they would go back and already have had their drink. You're at the door. You gotta remind the people to get their drink, or not. Well, no, tips. I would have wanted this to have happened already, like at the docks, well, asking the three main characters to give the twenty silver to the group so that they can like pay the tab. Yeah, well, they're going to put a tab behind, but are you going to remind them, or are they you just going to hope they do it? That's what I'm getting at. Well, okay, I'll hope they'll uh, they'll remember it then. Okay. They do. They they kind of realize, like, one, one of them goes up begrudgingly. Uh, Julia, Julia actually goes up begrudgingly. The two guys give her an elbow and goes, like, you got the money, and they're kind of, like, pushing her along, and they just kind of do it begrudgingly. But then she sits mm. down in the corner with you guys. Um, sure. And they can't. They she whispers to the bar- John and tells John where to send. It. Now, by the way, for the people watching the stream, John is a person in the group, and he's also a barman because <clears throat> John is a barman in every bar so far. Um, <laughs> yeah. So then, then they like all the tables get pictures put out in front of them and stuff like that. And yeah. Mm-hmm. What to do for us tonight? To keep drinking with these lads. Gonna. Try and continue to convince them. Try and just drink them into the stupor. Drink them well, under the floor um, or on the floor. I mean, at least chatting for a bit, but hopefully uh, getting back to bed at some point. Um, so, uh, I, I kind of need to know if you're in or out. Like, can we not decide in the, in the morning? Like, where will you be? Where is the ship? Because then, can I inspect the ship? Can I see the ship? Can I? Can I touch the ship? Can I rope the ship? Like, do you need us to sail? Is it like, do you need us to like fish while we're sailing? Do you need us to, you, to like you, man the man the anchor? You, you won't man be sailing like... the ship, but you will be helping to to sail the ship. Yes, you'll you'll be manning the, uh, the the ship as a crew. Um, there are food aboard, but if you want fish, we can fish for fish. Uh, fish yeah. for fish. I like the sound of that one. Mm, some cod, some 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 koi, some. Tuna, whatever other fish is in the sea, I can't think of anything. Octopus, uh, <laughs> some giant squid. Wow, uh, giant squid—they're hard to catch. Those bastards will take down a ship. Exactly. Yeah. You don't even have to fish for them; they'll come to you. You mean babies on the bait? And you mean baby krakens? Yeah. <laughs> and on the bait, we've got harpoons. If if I need to sweeten the deal for you. I am soon to be a um, a brewer at a very local uh, brewery, so I can, without you paying the, the drink, tab- without you guys paying the tavern, I can give you drinks. Yes, Free that is if we continue drink? being friends, of course. Re drink, you've again broken their brains. Um, you can also, they are fairly fucking hammered, by the way. I know. Um, I, I, I hope for them to, to like, forget half for of this. Well, that depends on how long a life you're willing to live. Yeah, are we talking a year? Are we talking 20? We are... Are we talking 50? Are we talking 100? We're talking, as long as you can remember my name, you'll be having free drinks. Ebrus, one sec. Can, if I get a tattoo, is that... I got an idea. Right, okay. If you pay for my tattoo, you've got yourself a, a deal. I will not be paying for a tattoo, although I can try and slap it, slap it into your face if you want. How does that... How do you get the name Ebrus slapped into my face? 
The hell Want I to see, see me it? try? Any man looks at the form and goes, <laughs> Yes? Are you, I know, as you slap him, are you slapping for damage or are you just slapping to like prove a point? I, I'm slapping to prove a point. Okay, we don't need to roll for that. We're going to say you hit. Sweet. Let's see how much he hates it. He hates it. Like he is like, oh, for fuck. Like he is like fuming, but the other two are laughing at him and it kind of works out as it, somewhat in your favor. Right? You're just part of the group now. You're, like, these are your crew. These are your, these are your drinking buddies for life now. Good. Um, I stand up to like leave the. Um... The, the table, I inform them where they can find the ship and where they can find me tomorrow, which would be right around the ship um, yeah. your dock, at midday-ish. Yeah, um, your, your dock ship should be somewhere in the trading quarter in that sort of area of the dock, mm -hmm. which is not where you are now, but yeah, you've, you've told them that much. Yet. I know, yeah, and as I leave, um, I mentioned that this trip will uh, reward them with the five gold pieces each and then I leave. Ooh! Half of what you you were told you can give them. Nice. Cool. Yeah. Well, I, I I'll be keeping the rest for like the the, the other part of the crew. <laughs> yeah. Well. Yeah. I thought anyway. Good matter. Um. Yeah. Cool. Uh. You go to bed. I well, go to bed. Yes. Where are you gonna go to bed? You're looking for an in a room in this inn. You um, go back to the right over the road. Uh. Back to over the road. Yes. Great. Let's see if you get bugged. No, you're good. Um. Man, how funny it'd be if after all that you got mugged uh, as the guy who pulls his trousers down. Oh. I barely have money on me to be mugged for, but sure. Yeah, but he, a, a thief I doesn't go, oh, I'm not going to mug him. He doesn't have 25 gold. They don't, they're mugging you. They're muggers. You're burning. Yeah, Arr. just just like the Kraken won't know if there's a female on board. Yeah, I know. They you've broken their brains in that pouch. <laughs> but yeah, uh, trying to get a long rest. Yep. Using the alternative definition of mugged, as in hit over the head with a mug. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that'd be brilliant. Uh, we're we're going to take a so, five minute break, um, unless you two want to do anything. As a recap, yeah. did the dwarf just lie to our potential crewmates about where we're going? Yeah, but who knows how good they are at sailing? If they if we don't grant them a compass, they probably won't know it's the wrong way until we like throw them off the ship. I guess. We're not going to just throw them off the <laughs> ship. Okay, I'll kick them off. Well, the point is, will they know the difference between... They're not between... going off the ship. <laughs> so you just leave them there to die? Well, unless we're going off, they can come with us. <laughs> but the qu sure. what are you going to do when you get to the Sandy Isle? The Sandy I don't know, Isle. bringing them along, apparently. Yeah, they're like, not allowed are, off the ship. Are they going to know what's any different to the homeland? Or the, the mainland, sorry. Well, have they been to the homeland before? We never asked. We never asked. <laughs> For God's sake. <laughs> Listen, the dwarf is a liability and I'm living it. <laughs> How long till I can learn the plane shift spell and get the fuck out of here? <laughs> <laughs> oh, like, you know, I want a reality full of where everything is clouds and rainbows. Yeah, literally, I'll shift myself to the, to the astral plane. Clouds and rainbows, mate. <laughs> Take right. me with you, don't worry. Or, or Adrag calls it. He's happy. You're place. not coming, you're staying right here. <laughs> Ibras finds his way in the astral plane, and for some reason he's been punching rainbows for three days straight. He's now got Super Saiyan. Um... Mate, in, in the end I'll be I'll be having powerful slaps enough to turn rainbows straight. <laughs> I don't know if any of you watched Dragon Ball Z. This is a complete tangent. <laughs> this has gone off the rails. <laughs> but in one of the series of Dragon Ball Z, when they're training to try and see if they can become strong enough to kill Boo, they go to this like temple in the clouds, and there's an echo chamber thing that like one hour in it is like seven years or something stupid. So they can train intensively for seven years and then come out. They're not aged more than a day. And they become super strong. So they did it to like make everyone like train to be like Super Saiyan 3 so they could kill Boo. But that's all I'm thinking about. It's the astral plane. It's this <laughs> magical building in the clouds. And, like... Which cloud temple? The uh, Azure Temple? The Temple of Gugol? Or, um, I don't remember. I know, watched it when I was like 12. The Temple of Amazing. I watched it when I was 12. And there's like... I, I'm, I'm 27. About. But all I'm thinking of is that. And then Adrian's like, oh, finally. Peace. Quiet. All right, tranquility. There, there, and Ibris comes in. Okay. And Ibris comes in just going, oh! Rainbow, I don't like them. Do, 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 do. <laughs> just like punching the shit out of it. <laughs> but um, yeah, unless you want to do anything before the end of the night, I want like we could take a five minute no, break. I just sleep. 
Yeah. I'd run you on. I know you went to bed while he was off doing stuff, but you want to rest or anything? I like rest. Rest is cool. good. I'm going to take a quick five minute break. I go pee and grab some stuff. Um, we'll be back for more of the what will the liability cause tomorrow? <laughs> <laughs> or how much more liability will be on the plates? And we're back. It is the next day. It's a beautiful, beautiful spring morning. And how are you both doing? Um, you bought your own separate rooms in the or over the road. So mm -hmm. you get up. Anything you want to do for the morning? Eat. Okay. You eat. Sweet. It's done. My day's done. So. I can go to sleep. Can I? <laughs> <laughs> you see from the right hours, yeah. Mm -hmm. You've lost one dex. You've lost some fitness from sleeping, oversleeping. Um, but um, <laughs> <don't>... how? <laughs> oh, I would like to uh, to oh. have you change that in the um, in the new pictures. Then go on. Okay. Oh, I, I lost one dex. Go on. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Well, it'll, <laughs> get, it'll take me a minute, but yeah. Uh, Vulcan, what are you doing? Oh shit! What am I doing? Turning off music so people can hear me better. Yeah. So again, talking to you. What are you doing? But are you, like, what's your plan here, buddy? Like, you're waking up the next day. What's the plan? Uh. Yar. Ibrius, did you find us a crew? I did indeed. And they are to meet us at the ship here later today. How many did you find? I found three. And three. their names be Doug, John, and Julie. Right. Have they ever sailed before? Doug and John have. Julie haven't. Uh, hasn't, sorry. Um, and one of them, I didn't know who, but either jo uh, Doug or John uh, has experience in repairing, and the on uh, other only has experience in uh, fishing. A fisherman, a repairman, and a woman. And a woman, indeed. Sounds like the start to Updated on stream, buddy. Hmm? Updated on stream. Oh, fuck off. <laughs> I can't just decrease my modifier like that. Well, you, you dared me. Ah, uh, true. <laughs> like, you can't blame, but you can't blame, man. Uh, so, I moved it back. I moved it back. Anyway, mm. yeah, so, yeah. Continue, lad, sorry. Um, Um, but yeah, I, I, I did find, uh, f f find some crew. Um, one small note is that they think we're going to the mainland, um, but I am hoping to pay them off with the 10 gold. Lied to them. We're not going to the mainland. I know. It's not initially. We are not going to the mainland as the first course of action. We're going to the mainland after going to the Isle of Sand, after go well, after going to the Africans, after going to the Isle of Sand. I do not Sand. want a crew that will mutiny against me. They need to they, know where we're going and be on board. They so they will be it. They will be knowing where we're going as soon as we set sail. I want to have to deal with a crew mutinying and not wanting to go with us. Listen, these people are poor, and the ten gold that we we can reward them with is surely enough to persuade them otherwise. 